um, wherever Sadio will play next season, he will be a big player, definitely. Relax, no pressure, nothing at all. And for sure, just enjoy it. What's that, Scardio scored in Munich? Probably if you, if you have um, five or six games, um, if it didn't score for five or six games, then it will not score that goal. But it was like completely natural, the whole thing. And it's, at the end, everybody criticized Neuer, but it was just world class from Sadio. You have to accept that as well. So, um, yeah, it's a good moment. Hopefully, it stays like this. That's the most important thing to us. The goals we scored so far are important, but not so important than the goals we will score. Um, until the end of the season, I think we. I think I can say we have uh, the best fans in the world, and they're just amazing all the time. You know how it's on the ground all the time. I think they they they, they play a big part, big part uh, of the winning every single game. So I think, uh, yeah, it's very important for us also to 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 feed them behind all the game and. He plays an outstanding season, Sadio is an outstanding player. I have nothing to do with the Ballon d'Or nomination and all these kind of things. I don't understand it really 100%. Um, he is world class um, and played again a really good game for us, but I have no idea. I, I don't know exactly how you come with that question. Now the season is not even over. Uh, historically, we have to win something to win the Ballon d'Or. I think most of the time, boss like this. If you are not Messi or Ronaldo, you have to win. Probably the Champions League, which we didn't do yet. So give us a few more weeks, and then we will see where we end up. And then Sadio wants to contribute. Sadio wants to help the team, and that's what I love most about it. Your goal-scoring record at the knockout stages in Europe is incredible. Every single time you score in the knockout stages, does something change? Does it? Is it more exciting when it's a knockout part of the group? Say again, sorry. In knockout stages of the competition, so not the group games, the knockout stages like now, yeah. you've scored in every game. Oh, really? Does, <laughs> does something change for you? Does it, is it more exciting for you? To be honest, I think uh, nothing changed and just excited. And hopefully tomorrow, so we score for the team and <laughs> pass through. Did you see us over the board? Did you see the vote? No, yes, I saw. No, Good. And uh, did you see last year what he played? What he did? How many goals he scored? What he, what he achieved with the club? What Liverpool was doing? And I think for me, it's a shame sometimes when the, when a team win this 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 trophy and after that, one of the players coming from there, you know, the winner of the Ballon d'Or not coming from there. But of course, I think I don't know. We have the criteria, but sometimes as well, I think when we see. As African, we 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 don't, we don't have solidarity because I think the worst votes coming from Africa. Now, I think this is our. Problem. Sadio, what's more important to you this season: the Premier League title race or successfully defending the Champions League? Good question, but uh, for sure I will say both because both is important for me, and both is our targets. Um, we are Liverpool, we are a great team, so I don't think so we should have problem about it. So I think we just. Still have nothing to lose because we can't put ourselves pressure. And uh, yeah, for sure I will say both. And how are things with you and Mo Salah? Was there ever even a problem there? Wow, good question. <laughs> yeah, I think uh, things can happen in football. I've been yeah, feel a little bit frustrated because uh, yeah, this football you want to score more goals. You want because you can see Man City is eight, six, seven, nil. You, you can't, you can see it, no. So for me, I think it was. For the team, I think it was really important for us to score as many goals as you can, but it can happen because he didn't see me and I was a bit frustrated, but we become a really, really good friend also. And yeah, yesterday, even yesterday, I said, Ginny, tell, tell Mo, why I you want to beat you in Burnley game? <laughs> and you know, Ginny is so funny, always saying this kind of thing, so, but it's all forgotten, it's behind us. So, um, Sadio is in the shape of his life, for sure. He's um, in a brilliant shape. Um, it's a joy to watch him in the moment, in training, in the game. Um, we ask him a lot. Football asks him a lot this year. An incredible long season, uh, a lot of finals, um, and these kind of things. So that's for sure so far one of the most successful as well for him and for us. Um, the Bayern Munich rumors, I, I, I couldn't 
care less in a moment. We are all, all fully focused on this game. Um, um, Sadio is completely focused on the game. He knows exactly how important it is to him and how important it is to us. And um, so no concerns, completely normal. It's not the first time in my career that before decisive games, Bayern Munich rumors coming up. I don't know exactly uh, why, what I did that that happens, um, but um, no problem at all. And uh, I think it's, it's, a, it's a dream moment for, for, for us, so let's enjoy it and without making ourselves pressure because it doesn't help. And my, my chef, I'm relaxed. And the boys as well, you can see everybody's smiling in the face, everybody's fully confident, I think, which is amazing. And even though, you know, it won't be an uh, easy game, but respect, especially if you play one of the best teams in the world. And uh, yeah, but I think that will make, even make the game special. And for sure, you guys are excited like we did. So let make make it and enjoy. It. Make sure it's gonna be a fire <laughs> fire game. <laughs> <laughs> so it's good. It's very thank you for the question because it's a very good moment because I, I, it's my fault. And I made a mistake. So like with talking to you about a Mo contract situation, which I usually didn't do, and needed to plenty of misunderstandings and stuff like this and if you ask again and stuff like this so I go back to my former approach and close the door again has nothing to say about any kind of negotiations of contract stuff like this it's really not for me here when we have something to announce you are definitely the first group who gets the information until then you have just to wait and about the quality of study we don't we really don't have to talk because that's absolutely incredible um, the quality he has, and uh, yeah, and obviously, the, what happened the last two months for him was was a boost. That's clear. I'm sure you find now a big election in in Senegal. Um, even with you, if we would try to, um, I'm really happy for him. I'm really happy for him, and um, all the rest we will see. Just on his physicality, that kind of shows his dedication and that, that, that incredible sort of yeah, but he's a talent as well. So uh, like, if, if you do the same training as Sadio, you will never look like him. Or if I do the same training now, it's not possible. He was, yes, he's blessed. Let me say like this. It is, this does a lot, absolutely, but um, was a bit lucky as well. Let me say it like this. Question, I will answer after Champions League. I'm staying over, no, I'm gonna answer after the Champions League. <laughs> I think right now I'm really, really focused for the Champions League final and we'll do everything possible to win it because it's my and all the boss' biggest dream. And then after the final, ask me, I will, ask, I will answer the question, okay?